speaker now is Brandon Tatum, former Tucson police officer and founder of the TatumReport.com. Brandon, your reaction to what we're seeing, people don't like a decision by a grand jury and a tragic case, uh, but the answer apparently is just being mainstreamed all over the United States tonight is you don't get the answer you want, but through our system, then you can do whatever you want, including uh, shooting police officers. That seems to be the new strategy from the far left. Well, Laura, you're 100 percent correct. I first want to give a shout out to all the officers out there holding the line, doing what they're supposed to do, um, holding the oath like they should. Um, this is a battle between the evil and the uninformed or the ignorant. You have people out here who are politicians and leaders who know better, but they're out here pushing false racial narratives and lying about what Breonna Taylor represented and that case represented. Also, you have the ignorant who are willfully not paying attention to anything. On TatumReport.com, we showed all the evidence of this investigation from 2016 all the way to now that shows the involvement of Breonna Taylor, that shows the evidence of the warrant, pictures, phone calls, everything that you need to be informed about this. We already revealed that and people don't wanna see that. That is a, a, a trend, tremendous problem that we see in America today. And we should not be operating like this. It is shameful in this country that because a person does not like the outcome of a lawful investigation that did not end according to what they wanted, they go out and kill other people. That is not acceptable and that's not a representation of America.